Hi, here's a fa final thought before um, Yom Kippur begins this evening. I heard this idea this morning as I was walking on the beach by Rabbi Wawa Jacobson, and I wanted to share it with you. So Kol Nidre is all about, if you look at the, the ideas of what are we actually saying, it's actually in Aramaic, Kol Nidre. It's about saying anything we've ever said, any vows we've made, any promises we've made, and we, we, they're not true, and we, we let them go and uh, release us from it, and it's as if they're nothing. Um, so it's really like what, what we say is null and void, like who could believe us in anything we're going to be saying. And he illustrates this by telling two stories. The first story is of, um, in India, how they train elephants. So baby elephants, when they are born, they are tied by a rope to, to a little, to a stick. And they try and get away from the stick, but they're tied and they kick and they kick and they kick and they kick. Eventually, they stop kicking. And a fully grown elephant who is tied by a little rope to a, to a, a little pole or a little stick is not even trying to to get free anymore. And for those of you who are from Africa and have seen these giant um, elephants in the in the wild, you know that these things can kick over trees. So what is a little branch or a little um, pole or something? How is that holding him back? Because it is what the elephant believes about himself that he can't break free. He's in that mentality and that mindset of that's what I am. The second story he tells is about the camel. So a young baby camel says to his mom, Mom, why do we have these ugly feet with three toes? They're so ugly. What's the purpose of them? She says, you see, my kid, your toes are specially designed to walk kilometers and kilometers in the boiling hot sand. And the way they are designed is so that you'll be able to do that. She says, that's really interesting, Mom. And why do we have these very thick, ugly eyelashes? Which is, that's also interesting because when the winds blow in the desert, your eyelashes are there to protect you from the wind, the sand blowing into your eyes. He said, very interesting, mom. And why do we have these ugly bumps, these humps on our back? Why can't we just be like other animals with a flat back? She said, good question, my child. She said, the reason we have these humps is because they store fat. And when we walk for days and days and days, we use the fat in our body to replenish ourselves. She said, well, that's, that's really incredible, Mom. Then my next question is, what are we doing here in the Bronx Zoo if we can't even use these gifts that we've got? Funny story. But the truth of the matter is, when we come to Call Nidre tonight, it's about how are we also keeping ourselves small? What are the lies that we have told ourselves to keep ourselves small, that tonight is the night to get rid of those, to open up our beliefs in ourselves that we can be so much greater. We can break free from those ropes that we've held ourselves back from. We don't have to believe those things about ourselves anymore. So tonight during Call Nidre, we are letting go of things that hold us back, things that don't serve us, negative beliefs and mindsets. Tonight is when that starts. And then we can fully grow up and become the potential that Hashem um, believes in us to be. Wishing you all Gemar Chatima Tovah.